hello guys welcome back to this channel hope everyone is fine on that note let's start this video so before getting into this i want to thank each and everyone for keeping a support to throughout this nptl journey guys so i wish you very all the best for your final exam guys and for your future as well so this is week 12 assignment so let's dive into this so guys these are completely our probable solutions if there are any changes i will mention in the comment section if it comes to our notice so please watch the video till the end guys so first question why is understanding the value that individuals assign to the protection of their personal data important for businesses so for first question the probable answer is second option guys to help businesses develop privacy enhancing initiatives that can provide a competitive advantage so mark second option as the probable solution for first question now let's move on to the second one second question which of the following is true so for second question the probable answer is third option guys privacy valuation can differ based on the specific context and circumstances circumstances so mark third option as the probable solution for second question now let's move on to the third question third question what is the core idea behind the privacy calculus so for third question the probable answer is second option individuals engage in a cost benefit analysis to decide whether to disclose personal data so mark for the second option as the probable solution for third question guys now let's move on to the fourth one it's a true or false question willingness to acceptance to produce privacy valuations that are substantially lower than those produced by willingness to pay so for fourth question the probable answer is false guys next fifth question which design approach is best recommended to address privacy concerns with digital contact tracing applications so for fifth question also the probable answer is second option develop a decentralized privacy preserving architecture that minimizes the sharing of personal data so mark second option as the probable solution for fifth question now let's move on to the sixth one so before getting into the sixth question question i want to make a small announcement guys so that is regarding exam preparation mcqs for the course cyber security and privacy we have collected past mcqs guys past nptel assignment mcqs with five years of nptel experience so here you are going to get a huge number of 120 mcqs 120 mcqs in a google drive pdf restricted link so 120 mcqs for one person it is 150 if you take it for combinedly for five persons it will be 500 so you can ask your friends or classmates to join along with you so that form a five members group and you can get it for 500 rupees only guys so mail me to this email id if you are confirmed to make the purchase bk179417 at the rate gmail.com so remember guys only if you are confirmed to make the payment then only mail us because many genuine students are waiting for us and we have to set everyone in the priority order so only if you're confirmed to make the purchase and payment then only mail us so this is the mail id i'll give the same email id in the description box as well so such option is available in this pdf guys you can search any question you want easily and it is also easy to revise because these are in the form of mcqs and validity will be till the exam results day and coverage is high syllabus coverage within less time so even going to the examination hall as well you can easily revise the questions case so remember guys 120 mcqs for one person it is 150 rupees for five persons combined it is 500 rupees so please share this news with your friends and classmates in your whatsapp college and official student groups so make some discussion happen on this and you can take this price guys for this price because for less price only you are getting 120 mcqs so team up with your friends so ask them to join you so take five uh, take this pdf as five persons pack to reduce more amount guys like this we have shown here so mail me to this email id already many students professors and associate professors have also taken this package so now let's move on to the solutions remaining solutions sixth question what does prospect theory suggest about how people perceive gains and losses so for sixth question the probable answer is third option guys losses are typically felt more intensely than gains 
नेक्स्ट सेवेंथ क्वेश्चन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग यूजर और कंसिडर्ड रिकमेंडेड प्रैक्टिस टू प्रोटेक्ट प्राइवेसी इन ए आई सिस्टम सो फॉर सेवेंथ क्वेश्चन ऑल दिस थ्री ऑप्शन आर करेक्ट ओनली दे सो मार्क फोर्थ ऑप्शन एज द प्रोबल सोल्यूशन ऑल ऑफ दू फॉर Uh, all of the uh, above as the probable option for the seventh question. Now let's move on to the eighth one, guys. Eighth question, guys. AI systems must comply with privacy laws such as the GDPR, such that. So the first statement: it requires transparency about the collection, use, and storage of data. And the second, uh, on the second statement, it mandates that consumers have appropriate controls to choose how their data is used. So for eighth question, the probable answer is third option, guys. One and two statements are true. Now let's move on to the ninth question, guys. Ajay enters into a contract with Bijoy to provide a service ABC to Bijoy. As a part of contract, Bijoy consents to processing of his personal data by Ajay. Uh, by Ajay, if Bijoy withdraws his con consent to processing of his personal data ajay may stop offering the service abc abc to bijoy as per the digital personal data protection bill 2022 bijoy is the what what is the role of bijoy so the probable answer is data principal so mark option first option as the probable solution for ninth question now let's move on to the 10th and final question Now moving on to the final question of the assignment, that is tenth one. What does prospect theory suggest about how people perceive gains and losses? So the last question of this assignment, as well as the whole course for this season, guys. So tenth one. So for tenth and final question, the probable answer is once again the repeated question, right? Losses are typically felt more intensely than gains. So mark option three as the probable solution for tenth and final question. So friends, these are the solutions for week 12 and final assignment of this question. Uh, this subject cyber security and privacy. So hope this video and our channel helpful for you guys. If you got benefited through our videos and channel, definitely please keep supporting us like this forever, guys. So keep subscribe our channel forever, guys. So I wish you very all the best for your final exam. So definitely take this 120 MCQs Google Drive PDF restricted link pack. For one person it is 150. For five persons combined it is 500, guys. So mail me to this email ID. pk1794170 at the red gmail dot com so for to purchase this package so once again i wish you very all the best for your final exam so do well in this exam and your and congrats for successful uh, enrollment in this so i wish you very all the best for your future as well guys so that's it guys so once again thank all for keep supporting me like this so please continue to do that guys so goodbye guys